You can hear the screams from family members as students walk across the stage. It's something graduates last year didn't get to do, but a JCPS spokeswoman tells me they've been working overtime to make sure graduates this year and last get this moment. Under a cloudy sky. <laughs> And it's damp, but it hasn't dampened the spirits. Endless cheers commemorate a day this sea of Seneca High School graduates have been waiting for and are grateful to have. I was just kind of mad that I knew that it wasn't going to be the same, but I'm glad that we got one because I really didn't think we would. Jesse Merriman didn't get to walk across the stage last year when all ceremonies were canceled, but she came back Friday for a special reason. She's joining dozens of other JCPS students from the class of 2020 who returned to get their diploma. I will be my mom's first and only kid that she will see graduate, and it was really big, really important for me to see her, to have her be able to have that moment. She deserved it just as much as I did. It was a year full of struggles for students as they spent most of the year learning remotely. But for some students, the hardships didn't end at school. Evelyn Clemens is here watching her little brother walk across the stage. He's probably emotional because his daddy just died at the beginning of the year. And my mom been dead for about seven years. So it, it, he's done had thoughts of dropping out. So we try to keep him motivated to finish. Accomplishments spread far on this field. As Gladys Isaire is here for her daughter, she says she thinks of the very journey she made to the U.S. from Honduras to give her daughter a better life. When she told me that she graduated with honors, it made me want to cry and it brought me great joy that I feel as a mother with the sacrifices you make for them. While signs of the pandemic are still present with mandatory masks and the usual indoor arena graduation moved outside, graduates say they're happy to finally achieve this rite of passage. This is different than everybody else. Not everybody had to go through this like past us. And we like we made it through this. We did it. We're here. We graduated. Gladys Bautista, WLKY 